with crazy breaking news coming out that Playboy Cardi is getting arrested with an assault charge against his pregnant girlfriend, man. And on top of the various allegations against Homicide Gang, it has a lot of people wondering if this is the end of opium, man. We got to get into the explosive new allegations that basically came out on a lay read against multiple members of the group. We got to get into this shit right now because it's looking pretty serious and it's looking like opium might just be over man we're gonna get into it right now but before we do i'm gonna need y'all to like comment subscribe we're gonna run up this video man make sure y'all check out the merch link in the description at staysafeworld.com man this is definitely crazy news it was reported tonight at midnight that playboy cardi was arrested in georgia on december 29th for allegedly choking his pregnant girlfriend following an argument over a paternity test according to arrest of david obtained by tmz the woman told police the rapper grabbed her throat and pushed her head until she could barely breathe she even told cops she thought she was gonna die and there was a witness police say the women told officers that she had been in a relationship with playboy cardi for two years and has lived with him since july 2022 and was 14 weeks pregnant at the time of the alleged incident on december 20th the woman told cops she wanted to talk to cardi about the baby and a conversation about a paternity test led to an argument which she claims escalated to a physical attack she told police a witness tried to jump in and break up the fight and when she was able to escape cardi's grasp she ran to her car where she claimed he was attacked again the alleged victim told cops cardi tried to pull her out of the car and put his hand over her mouth as she tried to use a vehicle's sos feature to call the police when cops arrived police say the woman had visible injuries on her neck. and playboy cardi real name jordan carter was arrested for a felony aggravated assault his attorney brian Steele, which you might remember is young thug's attorney told said mr carter was falsely accused pursuant to my communications with the fulton county district attorney's office this case will be dismissed without any prosecution or litigation man that might be good news let's hope that it actually does get dismissed but this is coming off of new explosive allegations against homicide gang multiple members it looks like they can't really decide which member this is about but it's basically accusing them of basically going after underage fans and stuff like that and unfortunately this situation apparently has led to them canceling the rest of their tour which they said they will not be able to finish and many people are pointing to the allegations basically dropping and at the same time of this dropping sort of just playboy cardi's allegations coming out sort of makes sense that the whole as a whole opium is going downhill not to mention that king carson a couple years back had allegations very similar to these playboy cardi assault charges so it's looking like opium might be facing a crossroads right now you know and on top of everything the fulton county da has definitely been looking at them as a new rico suspect so these dudes have to be on their best behavior and it's looking like that's the totally opposite of what they're doing and it's like it seems in these type of situations that you could have all the ops in the world and you can say whatever you want in songs but it always seems that the biggest threat that you have is yourself and when you get to these levels eventually you're gonna if you don't clean up your act and get your shit together you're eventually just gonna be going out sad going out bad you know doing these type of things man a lot of this shit could be cause of drugs and just being intoxicated and not really thinking properly and this is the end results of this lifestyle eventually they're gonna have to change because it's looking like they're either gonna end up losing all their money they're gonna end up losing all their fans or at one point they're gonna be locked up in jail if they don't stop this path that they're on man but you know it's really no telling anyone that has hella money and is currently big right now but unless they're saving up and really trying to make moves and doing important things and trying to be a positive light they're going to end up going downhill like a lot of rappers and entertainers have gone in the past man let me know in the comments what y'all think about that shit man real stay safe shit you already know what's going on make sure you like comment subscribe man peace